Hello everyone, welcome to another video. In this video, I will show you how to set up quickly texting, calling and email in Go High Level. Now, if you want a seven day free trial on Go High Level, click the first link in the description. And yeah, for more videos, you can go and subscribe to our channel for Go High Level videos. Now let's go and let's set up texting, calling and email in Go High Level. First of all, make sure you log in into your Go High Level go to your uh, agency dashboard and make sure that you're into settings. From settings, you can go to phone integration. This is the first thing that we have to set up actually. Now, there are two things you can do. You can either go with the LC phone system, which is lead connector. Um, this is fairly easy to go and install. All you have to do is just click use LC phone system. I acknowledge, confirm, and then you can basically go uh, through the entire process of adding uh, your LC phone integration. Now, as you can see for me, uh, they were not be able uh, to authenticate payments, so I won't be able to show you completely step by step, but this is the first thing you have to go through in order to connect your lead connector um, or in order to connect your phone number to your Go High Level. Lead Connector will help you with that. You can also use Twilio. If you don't have a Twilio account, you can go here to Twilio. You can create an account there on the Twilio website and then you can basically go and you can connect Twilio account with your uh, Go High Level. However you prefer and which one you prefer, it depends on you entirely. And you can also go here and see the sub account settings as well. So if you have already uh, a phone integrated for a sub account, you can go here and you can add a sub account to that particular phone number. Now, once we set up the phone right here, and once you went through the entire system of setting up your phone number, uh, again, if you have any questions regarding this system, you can comment down below. Uh, you can go here to your sub account, and from your sub account, you can go to settings, and from your settings, you can go to phone numbers, and you can actually add a phone number right here. Not a pool, but a phone number. You will be able to go and add a phone number. I don't have it right here because I haven't set up my lead connector, but you will have it right here uh, somewhere where you can add a phone number and make sure to add a phone number. Now, once a phone number is done, uh, you will be able to go to your uh, sub account to conversations and you will see all the conversations, uh, uh, you know, that you will be doing with your uh, clients, also the calls as well and stuff like that. Now, what you can do also is you can go back to the agency view here and you can go to the settings and from settings, you actually have email services right here. So this is how you can set up email services. Now, there are a couple of things you can do. You can set up lead connector. Again, if you have a lead connector, you can go to the dedicated domain here and you can add a domain. So this is a custom domain that you already have purchased on Namecheap or GoDaddy. And as you can see, you will be able to go and add your uh, domain name right here. So let's say if I add my domain name right here, I can basically go add and verify. And what I will need to do is I will need to basically go and apply this right here to the name chip. So what I will need to do is I'll need to go to my hosting uh, you know, operator, uh, maybe it's a name chip or GoDaddy, and I will need to enter the host name, the values and the status as well. So I will need to basically enter the uh, host name, uh, the, the type name, right, which is text C name and then MX records. So basically this right here. This is everything that we need to do and that we need to paste into our name chip. Now, once we pasted this, this into our name chip, we can verify our domain. Now, I will not go through the entire process as this process can take a lot more time, uh, but obviously this is how you can go and how you can enable, uh, you know, how you can enable email. And then once you enable the email, you will be able to go also to location settings if you want to see uh, you know, where the email uh, verification will be enabled or not. You can also go and switch to your sub account right here. And from your sub account, you can go to settings. And then here, as you can see, you have domains as well as media, uh, but you also can go to the email section as well. Now here, as you can see, we have a lot of different things on the left side here. And as you can see down below, we actually have email services. So we can click on email services and here we can also add and reply and forward settings. We also have that as well as email analytics uh, to see you know, whether or not we have sent emails, whether or not they've been delivered or not, clicked, complained or bounced as well. So that's pretty much everything you need to do. And uh, it is a little bit complicated for the people that are not tech savvy. 
So if you're not tech savvy, I can create another tutorial, which is a more in-depth tutorial. Also, if you want a seven day free trial of Go High Level, you can click the first link down below and we'll see you in the next video. Thank you guys for watching.